Hello everybody, I'm Ian. Let's read this story together. This is Log and Toad. Tomorrow, Toad woke up, wake up. Dread, he said. This house is a mess. I have so much work to do. Frog looked through the window. Toad, you're right, said Toad Frog. It is a mess. Toad pulled the covers over his head. I will do it tomorrow, said Toad. Today, I will take life easy. Frog came into the house. Toad, said Frog, your pants and jackets are lying on the floor. Tomorrow, said Toad, from under your covers, your sink and your kitchen sink is filled with dirty dishes, said Frog. Tomorrow, said Toad, there is dust on your chairs. Tomorrow, said Toad, your windows will scrub in, said Frog, your pants let it watery. Tomorrow, cried Toad, I will do it all tomorrow. Toad sat by the edge of his bed. Blah, said Toad, I feel dumb in the dents. Why, asked Frog, I am thinking about tomorrow, said Toad. I'm thinking about all of the many things that I will have to do. Yes, yeah, said Frog. Tomorrow will be a very hot day for you. <laughs> but Frog, said Toad, if I pick up my pants and jackets right now, then I will not have to pick them to pick them out tomorrow, will I? No, said Frog. You will not have to. Toad picked up his clothes. He put them in the closet. Frog, said Toad, if I wash my dishes right now, then I will not have to wash them tomorrow, will I? No, said Frog, you will not have to. Frog, Toad wash, wash it and dry his dishes. He put them in the cupboard. Frog, said Toad, if I dust my chairs and scrub my windows and water my plants right now, then I will not have to do it tomorrow, will I? No, said Frog, you will not have to do any of it. He dust his chairs, he scrub his windows, he water his plants. Dear, said Toad, now I feel better. I'm not in the dumps anymore. Why, asked Frog, because I have... I have done all that, all that work, said Toad. Now I can think tomorrow for something that I really want to do. What is that? asked Frog. Tomorrow, said Toad, I can just take life easy. Toad went back to the bed. He pulled the covers over his head and fell asleep. Thanks for watching for a day with Frog and Toad. Bye-bye.